Local tennis star Desiree Krawcheck was back home this week here in our desert taking part in World Team Tennis at Indian Wells. And given that yesterday was Thanksgiving, she's the perfect person to profile. They say gratitude is the best attitude. That's Desiree Krawcheck, genuinely happy and thankful, appreciative for what's been the most successful season of her career. Twenty-seven-year-old Southpaw Desiree Krawcheck has gone from local tennis star to global tennis star. All of it happening in a matter of months. Being at these Grand Slam events, it's a dream come true, and to be able to compete there and be rubbing shoulders with these big top names is amazing. So I just think that it's just been really cool to do this, and you know, I'm just really, I'm really happy. Hard not to be happy when you win three Grand Slam titles in one season, all of them in mixed doubles. Desiree was crowned first at Roland Garros, then at Wimbledon, capped off by the U.S. Open. The reward after the hard work we've done, you know, this past. Gosh, 11 months has been amazing. It's been incredible, and I'm really grateful to be playing all these tournaments and be grateful to be in these finals events. So, yeah, it's been amazing. Now, the only slam she didn't win this past season was the Australian Open. She'll have a chance to change that soon. But I had to ask her, out of the four majors, the four grand slams, which one's her favorite? You know, Wimbledon is just the mecca of tennis. It's a big contact, who's won another mixed doubles grand slam title french open champion wimbledon champion and there a hug for her partner at the french open joe salisbury be on center court was just a like insane feeling i was just speechless i actually walked out the wrong direction <laughs> onto center court so i mean it was i was just starstruck i was like whoa this is really cool you know just to be here so um but yeah i think wimbledon is my favorite australian open is one of my favorites um i think U.S. Open has just the vibe, the atmosphere. It's so electric, um, and you got French Open. You know, I, that was my first slam. You can't forget your first, so it's just amazing. <laughs> Winning is obviously great, but maybe the most important part in all of this is Desiree's impact on others, her influence on the next generation, specifically young girls who have dreams of playing professional tennis and possibly even one day winning a Grand Slam. I mean, it's incredible. I mean, I was obviously that little girl, you know, watching all these professional athletes like Kim Kleisters is here. You know, we've got all these other big celebrity names, you know, playing this event. And it's just, it's really cool to see that, you know, as I was a young kid, now there's younger kids looking up to me. So it's really cool. It's really special. And I'm just, I'm grateful. Really enjoyed my time with Desiree. She's as humble and kind as you're going to find. We look forward to seeing her back in our desert in March for the 2022 edition of the BNP Paribas Open. She did tell me that she will be here, so we cannot wait for that. That's going to do it for sports. As always, you can find more on our website. Just go to KESQ.com.